people good to be here again we have been waiting for the for the episode about intention of breakthrough still coming still on the way but today i want to take you a little bit uh, on a different uh, way or on a different something i am going to be showing you how to create free power from an ordinary massage motor I have a massage machine that broke up so I decided to see what this motor can do can you imagine this motor is able to power my keyboard it's able to produce enough energy to power my keyboard when I am rotating it using my uh, drill my cordless drill welcome let's work together we are intentional in this channel we will be sharing the doings of the Lord through the word of God and even through some lessons and courses like these ones to show you and to share the great mind that God has given us that we can do great uh, in the future I am planning a very big project but everything begins with one step a thousand uh, steps a thousand miles begins with one step so this is a step and I believe that I will be able to reach many and I believe that I will be able to help many and I believe that I will be able to transform many lives mostly in the rural areas where there is no electricity here we come free energy from a common motor from a broken massage machine welcome hit the subscribe button hit the notification button watch our videos and like our videos Karibu, welcome. Let's see what happens right from this moment. I got this motor from my spoiled uh, massage machine and I decided to try if it can produce power. And I want to surprise someone today. This motor is giving a cool 12 volts power, around between 9 and 12 volts power, that is able to power my keyboard right here. So just see what happens. Just uh, focus on the motor video. Focus on the motor. Uh, maybe you can go a little bit behind, a little bit behind, so that you can see the motor and the keyboard. Follow this wire. See this wire. This is the one that is powering here. Uh, I have customized my customized my keyboard, so I have two points of power entry. I have this one, which you see, it's not connected at all. There is no battery inside here. Maybe someone will say that uh, there are batteries inside here. Let me just show you. Let me just show you. Let's show you. See? There, there we go. There are no batteries inside here. And uh, you will also notice when I begin to rotate this uh, motor, it is when the keyboard will, will be powered. I'm using my cordless drill to do that. Now, I believe you are ready. Just watch what happens here. Just look at the keyboard. Just look at the keyboard. Let's look at the keyboard. Look at the screen of the keyboard and see what happens. Okay, uh, I want you to focus uh, the drill plus the screen so that uh, uh, everybody believes what we are saying here. See, it's on. It's on. I don't know. Can you be able to press the... This motor is producing enough power to power this keyboard. Uh, so just look at the screen when I remove the uh, screen of the drill. Uh, when I remove it, let me remove it. Let's go one, two, three, go. Off. I have one, two, three, go. On. One, two, three, go. Can you press it? Can you press it? One, two, three, go. Off. The keyboard is off. Good. Now let's measure the power that is coming, is being produced by, by, by this motor. Let's measure. I have, I have a multimeter here. I'm going to join the I'm going to join the cables right here. Black goes to black. Black goes to black, like that. Red goes to red, like that. Okay, my multimeter is set on measuring uh, direct voltage to volts, uh, direct voltage. So I'm going to put it on the 200 mark, 200 volts mark. Let's see how much we can get from this on rotating. Let's see, just uh, look at the screen of the voltmeter, and the drill is right here, and the cables are here. See, we got around the uh, 
8.6 volts because the rotation of this grill uh, is not that high. It goes around 8.6 volts. Okay, now the next thing that we shall do is to see if this motor can be able to power other machines like a normal uh, decoder or even uh, I'll try it on my CCTV machine and I want to see if it's gonna power my CCTV machine we are here let's go together so in the next uh, uh, in the next uh, uh, video we will see if it can be able to power other machines apart from the keyboard only here we come see you very soon